Hi, this is Tapcat. Welcome back to Marvel's Midnight Suns. Today we are going to go on the final mission of the DLC for Midnight Suns, at least the first battle pass or whatever they call it. I don't know if there will ever be another one, but it is the conclusion of the whole storyline with Dracula and the vampires. They have given me quite a roster, so as all of these are, it's two phases. Uh, but we're going to have different crews in each of the two phases. Blade is the leader, in effect, of this little outing. Without further ado, let's go ahead and start the cutscene for this mission. Enough is enough! We must destroy Dracula, cut off the head, and the new breed vampires will fall. We don't even know where to find him. Don't not know where to find him. I'm sorry, what are you saying? Honestly, I have no idea. I stopped reading scripts in 2016. I keep ad libbing. No matter how many people tell me to shut Unless up, you know I know where to find Dracula. Shut up. Exactly! Like that. <coughs> but no, I myself have no clue where the Big D and his army of foo fangers might be. But one of your clients might. Depends. You hiring? You? How? Doc Morbius said hemolisks give off a faint gamma signature, so I cross-referenced central satellite data to find concentrations of the stuff. Then, figured Sin never flies commercial. She thinks she's too good for it, right? So I checked shield data on private flights with suspected hydro connections around the time she first showed up in New York, then traced back to the point of origin. Oh, and that sunlight serum is basically magic in a bottle. I had a hunch the mirror table could pick up vats of the stuff. If they shipped it anywhere, why not home base? When you put those locations together and see where they all overlap... Voila. Dracula. And Sin, I'm guessing. You know I'm a journalist, right? By the goddess. What are we waiting for? Storm, what's the forecast? Clear skies ahead. Venom, eat anything behind us. Why stop there? Deadpool, Morbius, anything comes across that bridge. We Less talky, more shooty, right, Doc? Time to make a few house calls. <laughs> All right, I think I can remember this objective. We need to beat Sin. Wow, that's a serious castle. Funny how no one knew it was here all this time. Most we do have a Hemalus. I just wanted to make sure I get the lay of the land Maybe here. That's because it's pronounced Pen. Okay. A point well taken. Well, I don't have anything remotely capable of taking this out in my hand, so I think we can count on that thing spawning. I can, however, use Quick Claw, and I sure think it makes sense to. 
So let me uh, let me go ahead. Just trying to be careful about who I choose. I'm thinking about if I get something with knockback later. But you know, with this group, I don't even think I have knockback. I don't think any of these three. Uh, so that's a thing. Okay, unfortunately, this thing does not have quick. But I, I need to... Oh, okay. Well, you know what? This makes sense. Yeah, uh, sorry, I'm just contemplating here. We want to mark guys, but we also want to take some dudes out here. So I'm just trying to think, you know, who... Who do I want to, um, okay, that's a problem. What if I did something like this? I'm not sure I'm taking Sin out this turn. I'm not even positive how much I helped myself there, although... It's pretty huge getting all that card draw. Feeding Frenzy. Very good card. Okay. So we do at least have one guy marked now. But he has 300 health. So... I don't have anywhere near enough damage output to take him down yet. I need more heroism and I don't have an e Okay. I tell you what. Um, I... Oof. This is kind of terrible if I do it. Ugh. All right. Do this. I'm just gonna burn concealed. That's what I don't like. Because the only one who has a good attack in hand is him. So I had to use that card to get the heroism to do it, though. That's the problem. Alright, they're both the same. So I can easily take that guy out. I can take any of them out, but the difference is, with this guy, it won't cost me an action, because he's marked. So let's do that. And I believe I only have one card play left, which is pretty ugly for how many guys are left on the board. Um, okay. I only have one heroism. <sighs> okay, well this is quick. And I take it back, this does have knockback, so. What was I even talking about? All right, this is really helpful though. Softening the one guy up is not trivial, nor is taking out the minion. The way these things spawn, it's very, very helpful to, you know, prune their numbers. I hate letting this many guys do what they want to me. But I don't... It's not good enough. Uh, I tell you what, I'm just going to use this on a normal guy. It's going to thin the numbers, period. And I thought man thing was ugly. It's it also builds like my heroism, which I need pretty badly. Meditation. Uh, 
Okay. So... Yeah, this is actually pretty darn good, I think. And again, it still gets me more heroism. So I'm out of card plays, but Sin is, you know, the only survivor besides this guy. I'm aware we have the Hemalisk. So I was, well, I forget was. I am going to try a shove here. Hold on. Am I, uh, did I already? No, I didn't. That's what I thought. Crap. Okay. At least from that angle, it's not going to do me any good. Where's Morbius? Oh, he's still concealed? He's mist form. Next one attack. Because I didn't use an attack card, I used a heroic card. It deals damage. So mist form still counts. Interesting. Well, I want to do this. We need to start softening her up a little bit. Oh, and she's vulnerable. God, I hate wasting that. Alright, it is what it is. Uh, do I want to redraw any of this? I don't think so. Feeding Frenzy is really good. As is Shadow Strike. I, I'll get rid of Cornered. Arguably that was a mistake, but... Let's go ahead. Pass the turn. This world has a new apex. No more Ow. Somehow, I always knew I'd end up here. Wow. Okay. In Dracula's domain. Little old me storming oh, that sucked. castle with the daywalker and the living vampire? Oh, that sucked a lot. All right, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use mag dump having a good time. on this thing. Now, I'm not positive that was the right move instead of her. But it doesn't entirely feel like the wrong move. It was about to spawn and it was going to keep spawning. But my problem now is I can't do anything except use quick abilities on somebody who um, is not really, you know, going to be scratched. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's get some card draw. I wanted to damage the Hemalisk, but the more I thought about it, it's like... <laughs> Another heroic. It's actually not a bad card for this mission, though. Because, you know, if they're clustered, but I can't really afford... I gotta start getting rid of some of the, these heroic cards. I can't carry. Thank you, game. That's that's great. Hey, Ray. How are you? <laughs> All right, little guy. Come on up. Yeah. And they're killing me. I can't get anything. If I pass the turn, I'm not even going to draw anything. I have no heroism. Okay, Ray, come on. What do you want, baby? What's going on? I'm kind of screwed here. Here, want to come up? This is a really rough draw. I guess what I should have done is let that Hemalisk spawn, guys, because that would have given me targets. And when I got KOs, I would have drawn the card. I guess I should have used 
that attack on her and gotten her close to defeat. In hindsight, that uh, maybe wasn't the best. What am I going to do now? I think I should discard Pain Pinata. Use another bump. Try to draw something I can use here. I cannot be deterred. <sighs> You're killing me, game. It's just literally determined to give me nothing but heroic cards that I can't cast. Okay. You okay. All right. Uh, in my desperation, I thought to check something that I really never do. We are going to use Overdrive Serum. I really hardly ever even think about my uh, combat items. But if ever, you know, there was a time, I feel like it's now. So... She has four bleed on her, and on top of what he can dish out, we've got lethal, which is pretty awesome. An intriguing advancement. Okay. Um. Oh man, I'm gonna have to take her out again too. So let me do this, I guess. Uh, it's not a great use of four heroism, but this has we got to start softening this stupid thing up too. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, I think it makes sense to end the turn now. I'm aware I have one more card play, but. We share some of the same traits, the same blood as these mindless retainers. Speak for yourself. I don't see the resemblance. Aside from the team, <laughs> that unique vampire aroma you all seem to have? That's not what I was saying at all, fool. Okay, I literally wanted to trigger that stupid thing. Now I can finally use my quick cards and we get rid of the Hemalisk and the quick cards will help me draw into something that will hopefully be more helpful. So we'll see what happens here, but I, you know, I'm cautiously optimistic. These fanatics are always the same. Okay, that's not terrible. Let me see something. Can I push her back? No. All right. Never mind. Um. It's okay. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna fuss about it right now. Let me go ahead and do this. this. Get some. Okay. It sounds to me like they just missed their mama. I mean, that's not terrible. I need a lot more than that, you know, to take her out, but... I need... Get some bleed on her. one hell of a move yeah yeah no change in okay plans, it seems. so we stacked a bunch and there's a couple ways we can go here i can do this it's free so i mean it's fine blade doesn't really need to recover health but i will 
marker, which is also kind of irrelevant. I'll just go ahead and do it. There's no other reason not to. Hey, Okay, I'm pretty sure that this will just finish her. Yeah. Let's do it. Feeling strong today. Was that your full power? And then some. <laughs> Venom and Storm with me. Morbius, Deadpool. Can you buy us some time? Time for what? Let me guess. Tombside chat with Vladdy the Vamp Daddy? More of a pointed discussion. Once again, my disciple underestimates your power. As you underestimate mine. Be cautious when attacking Dracula with bleeding heroes as he has a high chance to counter bleeding attackers. Dracula also recovers health whenever he damages a bleeding character. You must see it by now, Dracula. Well, that's not great. Your game is coming to an end. This time, you will be our toy. So he is frenzied. Good. You are feeling confident. Which is not great for me. any excuses when you lay vanquished at my feet. Keep talking. I'm gonna okay, I, I gotta try and get some stuff in my hand here. Uh, let's do this. Let's see. Are uh, there really all of two? No, there's three minions in here. Okay, well, let's... Um, God, let me think. This is brutal. Um... I was torn between targeting the other vampire, the elite, or the hemolisk. That's a neat trick. Very, very challenging. I'm trying to think, like, who, you know, who can I take out here? Time to bleed. 
And you know, that's two plays down already, oh which means uh, Dracula is one away from kicking it into high gear here. Uh, like, what if I did something like this and get some card draw? Try to start softening him up. The bad side, of course, is um, yeah, I'm not going to get a KO. The only person I can KO with this is this clown. This isn't really going to do me any good because nobody is bleeding. I can use this. Get some heroism and card draw. Okay. I need I need to get Hellstorm activated. So I've had a chance to play with this some um, since, you know, we last <laughs> spent time together. This card is bonkers. It's insanely good. Now he's he's gonna not have come. get ugly here. Can't stop that. But you are nothing more than food. Mm -hmm. Okay. He got his shot in. Now I'm going to take mine. See, look at this. After drawing these cards, and by the way, so I have two live wires in my deck now. I decided I would try that. So her offense is up. That's weird that it's not showing, but it's somewhere in the 60s. Uh, let me see. It's half of her normal. Okay, I can't see it. But it's probably like 64 or 65, something like that. Each one. So it's huge. It's just a monster bonus. And I'm doing 399 for each, you know, storm card. This counts because she's on the left hand side. So anyway, let's just put this clown down for the count. I will show you for the first time. Yeah. I wasn't sure what to make of her cards, you know, when I first started playing her. Like a lot of these guys, we haven't done anything to tune their decks, you know, and you don't have any good mods on them or anything. They kind of suck compared to guys like the Hunter and Iron Man and so forth that you've really been working on and tuning the whole time. So it's very easy to just be like, yeah, this, this character is low. But I kept working with her off camera and um, she's got a lot of power for sure. So uh, that in particular, her legendary ability, crazy good. Okay, so now we can actually use this to good effect. Prepared. We're going to get rid of one of the Hemalists right now. Which is really important. Like, you know, I need to start thinning their numbers really badly as the next one pops. The elements have blessed me. Okay. Uh, it's got a lot of health left. Now, I could use this, but I kind of want this next turn for Drac. So, I'm thinking chain four, but it costs three. Okay, let's just do another one of these. Boy, there are so very many. Okay, we got two ways we can go here. One is I take out a minion, but I'm actually, or I could take out the Hemalisk. What I was thinking about doing though is hitting Blade and trying to draw a few more cards. Oh, I can't. 
Because she's not going to KO it, and I need this to be quick. So let's do this. The The biggest impact is if we get rid of the heat. So no more reinforcements. I mean, there's a million guys in here. But there won't be any more common. Okay, this helps except for the fact I'm going to give Venom bleed. But his attacks, all of his attacks, all of his heroics gain quick, which is huge. So even though he gains bleed, I, I got to do it. I just have to. Well, that's a lot. I don't have to, but I think it's the smart thing to do. Because assimilation, it's so good. Truthfully... It might possibly be the best legendary ability in the game. And I think the only thing that limits it is how many Venom cards you draw. That's really all it comes down to. Okay. So, like, see, right now it kind of sucks because I only have one Venom card. But if I get a KO, I will draw another attack. Okay, so I would need to... I think what I want to do... Let me hit this guy. He's stunned, so that's kind of a bad play, though, now that I realize it. I can chain this four times. What if I hit this guy twice and take him out? So does this mean I get three cards? I think it does, but we'll see. I think I get three Venom cards. Let's find out, shall we? Oh my god, there was another Hemos. So I've taken out two. <laughs> that wasn't enough. Okay. Now I only get one. Okay. I wasn't sure. Look at how many of these fools there are. Um, on KO, gain one strength, and I can use that. And I get to draw more, which, again, I really need that. Okay, it's not quite enough for that. But I'll take this guy out. Let's do it. Get rid of another elite. Never seen that before. So one option we have, by the way... If I look like I'm in any danger whatsoever of kind of running out of steam, I can use this. Um, this will KO three minions right now, which is, you know, pretty good. Is there anything? Not much. I can just pick up two. I think I'm going to use this just for the free heroism. Alright, I don't want to do this because it's not quick. And I need, I need to get as much mileage out of this as I possibly can. So let's use Crushing Blow here. It's going to cost me one heroism, but I'm okay with it. This thing's about to pop. I think I'm going to let it. Because again, I can always just take a bunch of these things out. Yeah, this is not great. It's the only quick attack I have. Well, if I'm doing that, I'm taking this thing out. I hate that I keep picking up more bleed. Because that just keeps turning more of these guys into elites and makes it harder. Maybe I should have used the thing first, now that I realize it. Yeah. Yeah. 
Wow. Oh, come on. That is just stupid. <laughs> well, now I'm screwed. I mean, now I don't kill anybody with this. I need card card draw right now. I think you got him. Perfect. Here's hoping it's something amazing. It does give me heroism. Okay. Playtime's over. We, you know, listen, you we could get out of this. Mouth. Okay. Coming back up to two at least. The problem is the symbiote bind doesn't help me unless I have attacks for him and I don't. I still have my discard. I think I need to discard something. And given that I don't really have any minions, which is mostly what this is good for, and also the fact that it's going to give her bleeding. Oh, wrong, wrong thing. Hold on. Let me do this again. And I even get rid of something. And meanwhile, we'll uh, draw another card. Now you must follow it. Uh, draw the last attack blade, okay. But I'm probably going to turn like the last minion into a elite because apparently we're at a, a point where there's almost a 100% chance of it happening. Alright. It would just be amazing as if I could draw something that would let me... Like what I need is a venom attack. A straight up attack. <sighs> okay. Well, this is good it, and it's quick. I just don't have card draw. Let's hit this guy. Give the mother my regards in hell. But it did give me some heroism, which is good. Um, chain three. I, I maxed out on heroism and I wasn't even paying attention to that. So, okay, maybe I'm being unduly pessimistic. Uh, let's, let's do this. Let's use some first. This will be literally everything. And then I can blow this up. Okay, hold on. Have Venom do it. Okay. I'm just gonna do it again. So, 
not going to get every last one of them down, but I came pretty damned close. And I think... I don't really want to give this up. Ugh. After I got this, I never got another <laughs> Venom attack. I'm going to hold it. Maybe foolishly. So now these guys will beat the hell out of us. Make it harder for us to win. But here's the key. All we need to do is take out Dracula. That's it. No, Nothing else matters. Last turn it mattered because, um, How many times must you know, fail before you accept the truth? we had to do it a second time and I had to survive their turn. We will not suffer your blood okay, this is just useless. Your appetites are your own beast. I simply gave you a so, reason to indulge um, them. I'm thinking I hit him with my big we shot here. We, we have this, actually. The hard part was surviving turn one. That was where we were at real risk of losing. Actually, we don't have this. <laughs> Uh, oh no, we do. It's over for you. Wait, maybe we don't. I don't think I got the KO. He is a sliver of health. But what is his health? Twenty-two. All right, we're good. Don't get up, even if you can. this I'm not missing the boss fight You've won. Without my grand endeavor, nothing will protect you from what is coming. We'll manage. Oh, uh, did you want to get a lick in? Oh, no. You had it handled. My concern, as always, is the bigger picture. The new breed of empires are no more. No more bad food. Maybe you like pancakes? It is past time we go. I've never been so happy to see a shiny blue hole. Oh, except for the time I met Ronan the Accuser 
beautiful. Do you think he's really gone? I'm cautiously optimistic. All right, there could be another cutscene when we get back to the Abbey. We'll see here in just a second. I definitely feel like in both phases of that fight, I really put myself behind the eight ball. I made... So, as I was saying, um, I think I made some key decisions that put me in a bad place. Thankfully, I was able to overcome it. And it wasn't the end of the world, but it came very close to costing me the mission. This is, by the way, one of the most difficult missions, I think, other than the final part of the campaign. Um especially the phase two there where you have so many of those vampires in the room with you, three hemolisks spawning stuff out and then a frenzied Dracula. That is a really dangerous combination. And I think unless you're playing on a very low difficulty level, um, you better have your crew, you know, with pretty solid decks and, you know, leveled up and all that, or else I don't see it going well. At any rate, I hope that you enjoyed this. I certainly enjoyed playing it, but that is all for now. Thanks for watching. Hope we see you next time.